Hey everybody, and welcome back. So, in the last video, we tried... Oh, wait, wait, wait. We gotta get that bed music pumping. Yeah, bed music. Ugh. Anyway, regardless. So, in the last video, we tried, um, you know, boosting the gain on the microphone, seeing if I could take a step back from the microphone. I think I just need to retry it, like... Uh, it's been a while since I tried microphone arm. I, I think I might need to try microphone arm again soon. We shall see. Anyway, regardless, people. Um, so, yeah, I, I want to play more Switch game and review more Switch game. And so we shall. Yes. So we shall. Uh, yeah, this one, Agelos, Agelos. It should be a jealous because um, the double G with a vowel following. Anyway, you know, like the word agitate. If it's a consonant following the double G, then it's a G, like aggravate. If it's a double G with a vowel following, it's J, agitate. Anyway, hey. Wonder Boy, Bobby, Storybird, look at my game, P Cube, Click Team. Uh, anyway, this game uh, it was created um, in the vein of was it Wonder Boy or Alex Kid or one of those old franchises? I forget which. It looked like an ordinary day for Tunic Swordman. But something was drawing you toward the western woods. Oh, was it now? Oh, the base is gonna drop. As if your destiny was awaiting you there. Oh, feel that base drop. Yeah, this is just like an ocean view, Patrick Patrickios. Yeah, I give credit where credit is due. Okay, there's my jumples. Jumples and sword swingles. Okay, please tell me breakable. Come on. Pots aren't breakable with sword swing? Five. <sighs> okay, I get crouchels. Okay. All right. So here we are. Yeah, this is very, very old school in its look and or feel. I wish I could hear its sweet chip tunes, but I, I can't for low the content matches oh god get away from me ah birdie ah oh give me that whatever it is i got three eggs and completely failed in my mission to not die oh really you're gonna jump and then this kitty jumped up as i was okay kitty you're kitty don't step on my keyboard Get the freak out of here. Kitty, I'll tell you what though, like the keyboard sound is great. Okay, how do I open this? Do I need an key? Okay, kitty, I'm so glad this kitty, this is the, oh, the, how did I even do that? I found a herb. It will heal you automatically if you lose all your HP. Yes, that's right. I pronounce it like an British person. Like a... Ugh. Take that. T oh. Oh, I'm going to sneak upon you and then get all your monies. Yeah, I like how the hearts are not just a single hit. Because it helps you to know that, like, you can get hit potentially many of times. Ooh, here comes princessy type girl. Ooh, time for a friendly dance, Nico staff. You are correct. Save me, please. Okay, so A is advance. You're refusing. In that case, prepare to die. No, don't sword me in the nethers. Oh, come on. I sorted him. I'm fine, thank you, but I'm a princess lies of lumen. 
Valion kidnapped me some time ago. I managed to escape, but the kingdom is in danger. We must seek out the king. What? I have to take shelter in your house? Very well. If you think it's too dangerous for me, you will meet the king and send me an escort. But you should know that the castle is not accessible through the main entrance. You have to go through a secret passage. There is a cave in the forest to the west of the castle. The passage is there. We must hurry. Be careful. Wait. <laughs> Am I? Where even are you? What? Thank you again. Do not forget. It's absolutely necessary to meet the... Cave under the forest to the west of the castle. So, because this is 2D, I'm gonna assume that west means to the left. Because which coast? West coast. West coast, best coast. And the rest coast can stay dressed coast. Anyway. Haha! -ha! Fire on you! I've learned your attacking patterns. Oh, what's this? Should I touch it? A save point? Oh, okay. Yes, I will save this game. Game is saved. Cool. Wait, it's making me glow. Ah! You're a bear. I swatted you many times before you got me. Oh, flower, if I knew you sneezed on everything, I wouldn't have bothered. Ugh. Okay. Oh, no. The flower sneezed. I, I didn't get hit. Okay. So that's the castle, probably. And I'm going west. Wait. Is this the cave of which she spoke? Do I have breath meter? I don't see a breath meter, and I can't hear the audio, so if I'm about to die, if it's going... I would have no idea and no way of knowing that. Because I'm listening to Mirror Mind by Bobby Richards. Thank you, Bobby. Wait, what? Can I charge in my jumbles? I, I guess I can't. Perhaps there is a certain combination Metroid slash Castlevania Symphony of the Night vibe to this game. Oh, really? You're just gonna walk around with your hard shell and then act like it's my fault that I got hit. Oh, that was cheap. I'll cheapen your... Ugh. I hope I, like, heal when I... Level up? Yes, I do heal. Boom. Shazam. Shazam a lama ding dong. Anyway. <clears throat> yeah, I'm very much digging these old school vibes. Because, you know, as you may or may not know, I am an old person. Yes, you thought I was very young, didn't you? Haha, <laughs> well, I'm fooling you with my foolage. Wait. What? They give you way more. Oh, I see what's happening here. Okay. Okay, I definitely need to fall more to the right. I thought I was trying not to overdo it and as a matter of fact I underdid it so let's try that again shall we what oh what come on smile slinick slinick slink slink agilos 2 the adventures of slink oh slink's quest Oh, man. 
Oh, I see. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, okay, so there's no way for me to fall onto it from there, so I have to do it from the other one. I just, if I go to the other one, it doesn't look like there's a way for me to get back. No obvious means of regress. So... Uh, give me the hands. Ra. Okay, ra. Oh, sorry. Oh, I missed, I still missed it. I'm very disappointed with myself. Okay. But I'm having a dang good time. Hey, look, this is like some... I feel like dubbing my steps into this music. I take some steps and then I'll just dub them in later. Like, I love how much dubstep is a recycled genre. Like... It's like, hey, what are you doing differently than the Chemical Brothers did in the 1990s? And the answer to that is, oh, we have this sound. Wah. Okay. Oh no, <laughs> the answer is not jump, dingus. Oh, heart, yeah. Heart, yeah. That's what I say to my lady type friend. I'm like, She'd be like, do you love me? And I'd be like, heart, yeah. Yeah, because I don't play it cool. What am I, Han Solo? You're Han Solo, you're going to be playing with your Han Solo. Anyway. Okay, I don't get how to open chests. Because I don't know how I opened the last one. I'm pushing all the buttons. Clearly. I'm pushing them all at once. Okay, hold up. I gotta pause the video and I gotta pause the game and I'm gonna find out how to open chests. Well, as always, the internet was no help. Let that be a lesson to you, me, and everyone else. spend so much time trying to get here if I didn't like <sighs> oh no don't quit game return okay but how do I open this chest this having oh there we go I hit it slightly differently you hit it with your sword, but you have to, like, hit it exactly on the lock, I guess, is the answer to that question. Okay, let's miss that fish and hit this hermit crab and get some hearts. Yeah, baby. Heart you, babylicious babes. Okay, I got another, yeah. Oh, and what is this, pray tell? To Lumen Castle? That's where I'm going. Okay, I obviously can't get in here. There's a cave to the west. What, are you a cave? You look like a snake and a breathy plant. Ha uh, ta. Oh man, spiders and trees, like that takes me back. Spiders and trees, that was such a staple, like... Oh, come on. I didn't mean to hit your breath that time. What? Are you a cave? Okay. Yeah, I'll check my map in the menu, but first, I'm gonna save. Yes! Okay. Alright. I'm gonna go in your house. Try to always have a cure to come back when you don't have any left. Okay, nice lady. I will come back. Wait, why did I go back in? 
Also, whose house? Run's house? Ooh, that looks like a monkey man. Go to your inventory to use a potion. How much? 20 gems? Sure, I'll buy a small potion. Thank you. No, thank you, sir. Monkeys are not the... Oh, the monkeys steal things. Wait, what? Even things that are useless to them. Oh, okay. So... Don't mess with the monkey. When you're on a platform, press down. Yeah. Wait, down jump to go faster? Okay. Ooh, let's talk to the armor swordsmith man. Don't forget to equip the armor and swords you buy. Okay, I shan't. Steel sword for 80 gems. Let's look at the armor. Steel armor for 60. 80 and 60. That is, an, I have enough to buy both of those things. Yeah, buy the steel sword. Thank you. You bought equipment. Yeah, I'll, I'll tell you when I'm ready to equip. Thank you. I have two gems left. Okay. Let's go to our equipo. And let's go steel sword. Ooh, plus seven. Ooh, plus five on the, yeah. From what I had before. For reals. Okay. Let's look at the map. Bosco, huh? That's the same as my uh, ATM pin. Oh, my sword is like longer now and more swooshy. I've always wanted a swooshy sword. I'm gonna go hit that monkey with it. Oh, I'm gonna hit that monkey with a sword. Oh, you some of the... He took my... <laughs> sure, I'll save the game after that monkey stole my uh, eggs. I know they're supposed to be coins, but they look like eggs. Yeah. You did warn me about the monkeys. I thought I would be able to... You know, like the little... Uh... <sighs> the little person in Golden Axe. You know, the one who like steals your things and you're like, I can't believe you're stealing from me. Didn't your mother never tell you to not do things like that? Ugh. Oh, crap. Ugh. Oh, you can jump at me? That is information I did not have before. <laughs> okay. We are doing a thing. Okay, let's try to... The door is locked. Curses! Yeah, and then we were just down there. Okay. We're gonna keep going. Have at thee! And have at thee! And how about the fact that I know I'm going to hit a save slash restoration point soon, so I'm not too incredibly worried about my hit points. I'm just worried about not being able to hit the spider if I'm too far away. Ha. Uh, clearly. Ugh. Okay, got me some coins. Yeah. Save points still where it used to be. All right, save that game. Thank you, Mr. Man. Wait, are you Manfred Man? And his rare earth band? Manfred Man has his own rare earth band. Can you believe it? Like, do you have your own rare earth band? No, because you're not some of the bench. Spider, I shouldn't be talking about Manfred Man and his rare earth band and how he revs up feminine hygiene products. You know what I'm talking about, right? 
another runner in the night. Okay. Oh, some of the bench. Yeah, give me that heart. Oh, crap. I just totally fell off that ledge. Okay, is this a cave? Bosco Cave Earth Temple down below. Okay. Like I'm, I feel like I'm doing what needs to be done here. I still don't know how to open chests. <laughs> like that is a problem game like okay <sighs> oh my enduring experience of this okay so I guess you have to sword up I wish you could wall climb in this this would be a serious boon double jump or wall climb those are probably like if this has metroid type vanias you know the ones Oh, look at you, you jubbly clown. All right, let's find out what jubbly clowns do. Oh, he gets scary. He pulled a scary face. All right. Don't mess with jubbly clowns. That's what my mama always say. Yeah, I got you before you got me. That's the golden rule get them before they get you not like that secret fake golden rule that um Jafar is an old man in disguise gives Aladdin in Aladdin aka Disney's Aladdin okay what I think you just push up on the chest I did not try that because that is not how I've ever opened a chest at a video game before. <laughs> okay, so apparently I have no down swipage, so I cannot break downwards. And I cannot break bad. Pretty sure I can't uh, go from, you know, family man, chemistry teacher to drug kingpin yeah of course door is locked um over the course of a series oh guess who's getting wrecked you are oh no that was <laughs> poor planning on my part okay uh, let's come back huh. oh dang it okay guess who's getting an erector set Huh? Me. And I'm not going to invite you over to my house to play on it. Oh no. He made his scary face at me and I panicked. Ugh. Don't bubble your jebels at me, kind sir. What even are you, floating orb of death? Are you just that? Is that your entire self? Oh. Oh, Mole's gonna give me downward diggle power. Oh, take this, young warrior. Is it soft knives? Oh. Oh, I can. Ugh. Downward attack now. Okay, so there is some Metroid type vanias in this. Oh, yeah, boy. Ugh. Wait. There we go. This is fun. I'm having a good old time. Like a good old time. It's like a good time, but it's also retro styled. It's a retro themed old time. You know, when you're having a good old time. Ah! I do not want to backtrack to that. Okay, he gonna make an angry face. And he gonna make a snaky face. 
Okay. And I will not have any of that batitude, young man. Your bad batitude. <laughs> oh, Robin. Boy, wonder I've done it again. I've used bat in a way to make a pun that is in no way acceptable to any living person. Oh, you know it. Okay, I feel like maybe I should have gone to the right. Okay, bruh. Oh, I should have, like, downsorted him. Oh, well, it's too late now. I... Yes, think about things. Oh, and also, like, I have another heart container now, I guess? Because I am a smart man? Okay. Where was my other downsorticals? Like, there was a place where I was like, Boy, I wish I could downsword. It was, like, way back at the beginnings. Anyway, so yeah, vibages. Yeah, it's right there. Like when I was like, hey, why not down sorting? Oh, come on. Oh, right. Yeah, I do like that down sword animation though. This is key. Oh, this fish looks angry though. You know, come at me. I hope I get fish power for the swimming upwards in underwaters type environs. Oh, come at me, bro. Sword you right in the face. Turn you into a sordid fish. Not a fish with a sword nose, but a fish who has been hit in the nose with a sword. Okay. Ooh, I feel like... Wait, is this loose brick? I'm gonna push up on it. Oh, come on, Mouse. Mouse Rat. That'd be a good name for a band. Mouse Rat. Oh. Yeah. Okay, I have a timer <laughs> going for the tie-dyed t-shirts that my daughter and I were working on. And I feel... Oh feel like that's gonna go off in the middle of the thing somehow. What? A cat just shook its head and almost destroyed my life. Uh, I think that's just vital information for you to have. Anyway. I don't know what you're gonna do with it. Just have it. Enjoy it. Build a, a life with it. Tell it to your grandchildren someday. Wait, was that a knock on the door? There perhaps hath been a knock on a door. Oh, wait. Uh. Hey, is it just me or has ever since, um, certain uh postman what are you strange crack yes there is ever since certain um postmasters generals i won't say which one and i will neither confirm nor deny that it's the joy yeah i know the door is locked i have to come back to it at some point what Outside, but now I am encastled. Whoa, swingy cactus man! Oh, you! Oh, wow! And now Triceratops thinks he can best me in a sword fight. What? What even are you? It's more like a monoceratops, if I'm being perfectly honest. Okay, yeah, I can't get up there yet. So we're going to call this part for the Metroiding of Vanias. When I'm ready to Metroid some... Va Wait, hold up, though. There was a guy with a... I want to say a halberd. 
Sakura. What are you doing here? What did you say? The princess is hiding in your house? Very well. We will send an escort to bring her to back. Then I will take you to see the king. Yes, see the king I shall. That's a very long game opening. You protected my daughter. I'm eternally grateful to you. Lice, you told me the situation is serious. What is happening? When I was captive, Valiant said that he finally had all four elements in his possession, and that destruction was upon us. I couldn't really understand what he meant about elements, but he's probably planning another attack. Oh wait, that was still her. <laughs> uh, this is why my, my voice acting career has never taken off. So that's what it was. Not long ago, Valiant abducted my daughter and wanted me to hand him the key of the kingdom. Or he would hurt her. He's gonna hurt the daughter that I have. Oh my god. I gave in. He wanted a key to get access to the Yoi's temple. As Lee said, he now has all four elements. But what is he planning to do with those? Oh, have you not played like any RPG, Monfrunda? Like, look, when the bad guy collects the elements, it's bad for everybody because then he basically tries to Thanos everything. I mean, come on, at least you've seen Marvel movies, right? Do you have those here? Anyway. I understand now. It's a tragedy. No, it's a video game. See, there are four elements in nature. Actually, there are a lot more than that. When you say element, do you not mean the same thing that I do? Earth, water, fire, and air. Oh. Am I going to get a blue arrow on my head? Tell me I won't. This is... Theses elements are the base of our world, the world of light. Theses elements. Light is the ultimate element. Each of these elements have their opposite. There's the world of light, but also the world of darkness. Ooh, world of darkness. Are we going to do Zelda Link to the Past Dark World? With these elements, he can transcend frontiers and open breaches between two worlds. Oh. Strange crack of the castle. Oh, -ho -ho. now it is only a crack, but soon it'll be a door and there will be more. What will happen when these doors open? I don't know. This world is built upon harmony and balance, but the other world is a disorder or chaos. He's surely planning something disastrous. In that case, we must attack. His army is weak, but so is yours. You will never get him. The portal's opening and inevitable and imminent. The only solution is to collect all four elements to prepare for an attack from the other world. <coughs> what? Who burped? Who burped into my microphone? Who? Which one of you did that? They won't say. Oh. This song m reminds me of Your Cylinder, the play. Remember that play that everybody was jazzed about? This is like a YouTube parody. Everybody was all about that play circa 2020. Now it's 2021. And remember when we decided that we would never say 20-ish? We'd just always be 2000 and? Yeah. We'll send troops to collect elements. That would be useless. We can't assimilate the elements' essences. Only special beings can. Who will do it then? Um, I don't know. Tunicman? Him! Brr! What? Yeah, have you guys seriously not played a video game before? Anyway, I'm loving how, like... This is, like, good use of trope. This is, like, excellent tropage. The gods gave me a vision. Now that he's the one I saw, I don't know how or why, but he, like Valian, can assimilate the elements' essences. You already did a lot by saving my daughter. You're a great warrior and only a chance. Will you embark on this quest to save us? Oh, I hope, I wish I could say no. <laughs> yes, I knew you would. Here, take this. This is the key to the kingdom. 
Oh, can I open doors now? The same that was given to Valley. This is, you should go to the treasure room. I have to go back to my quarters. If you ever feel lost, come to me. I'll use my powers to guide you. Oh, cool. Okay, well, I obviously can't make this episode much longer um, because it's already, you know, more than half an hour long. And that's, I try to, I strive to keep them within that realm. Yes, save my game. Okay. So I think, I, I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna, you know, do the thing right now. And so we're just gonna, um, we're just gonna we're just gonna we're just gonna pause and we're gonna put a score on this okay everybody welcome back to the infinite regression i finally i processed my thoughts i've created a score we're, we're feeling about it we're having feelings about it so a jealous which is how i'm going to pronounce it i know that other people have pronounced it different ways and you know what they can feel about it however they want I know that it's pronounced a jealous. Anyway, uh, based on simple phonetic rules. Um, so yeah, a jealous is a game. It, it is. You can't tell me it's not a game because it 100% is, in fact, a game. Um, and so it being a game that I have played and had fun playing the whole time. I did, I had fun the whole time. The only time I was having fun was when I couldn't figure out how to open a chest. And there should have been a little bit of, you know, dialogue or something above it being like, push up, dummy. Like normally if you crouch by it and hit it or like just walk over it or walk up to it or like, I was just thinking about chest mechanics in other games that I've encountered. <laughs> Um, it seems like easier to open. Uh, regardless, the fact is, uh, that was the only time. Ooh, look, it's midnight misspelled by noir et blanc, etc. Uh, no, noir et blanc v. <laughs> Wait, black and white life. It is spelled midnight with a, uh, yeah. Okay. All right, we're going to ignore that. So, and it just enjoy the music and not think about how pretentious any of the names of these things are. Anyway, so I put a final score on it because I was enjoying it the whole time and it was giving me old school vibes in the best way. Like, we have hit critical mass on pixel art games on new consoles. Like, we just have. Um, because indie developers have realized, like, hey, if we make really good games and we just, um, you know, take our sweet time and baby these things and create really, really good games with really good gameplay, um, then people will respond to that and they will like it and then we, that will be a good thing. <laughs> and indeed, indeed so. Uh, so yeah. I, I done did went and played this game like it I saw that it came out there was a physical release of this game and I was like I don't know I want to spend 30 some odd dollars on a physical release of a pixel art game you know what I'm saying I like I would do it for um Axiom Verge I would not do it for like a robot named Fight Although, it's not like I hated a robot named Fight. Like, it was a decent enough game. It's just, like, when you've hit critical mass on pixel art type retro styled games, what that means is, like, you've got to bring it. And, and uh, Agilos brings it in the best way. It totally used all of the, like, you have to go save, the, you have to go see the king. And... Uh, this is the princess and you have to go through a cave to get to the castle and like all of this stuff like it it's such video game tropes but like they use it in they use it well they know what they're doing and there's almost a little bit of a, a wink and a nod like hey and guess what a wink is as good as a nod to a blind horse I thought it was important that you know that um, anyway but the fact is, like, they, they did it in such a way that it was really good. And that's why, ra, my final score for Agilos is a 9 out of a possible 11 Rygars. 
Now, if you don't remember Rygar, oh man, that this is an NES game is total classic. Um, I remember the first time I saw it, it was at a, it was a, the house of a friend of a friend. So I would have to, in order to play this game, and I only played it like once or twice when the uh, NES was still a thriving thing. Anyway, so like I would have to go to the house of a friend of a friend and the only way I wasn't really friends with this guy, but my friend was. And so if I went to his house and then he had the idea, it was like, hey, let's go to Bobby's house. And then we go over to Bobby's house. And if Bobby's dad wasn't playing it because Bobby's dad totally played video games at a time when it was like, what? Adults don't play video games. And they didn't. You could look at the sales figures. Like, they really, by and large, did not. Um, anyway, so, yeah. Uh, Agilos, yeah, was a game I, I saw, like, the first time I saw it, I saw this kid's dad playing it, and he was wicked good at it, and I was like, oh my god, this game looks amazing. Um, and then I didn't get to play it. Uh, and then the next time we were over there, I did get to play it and I sucked at it, you know, and it was a long time before I got my own NES and my own copy of it. Like it was well, like we were into the 2000s. It may have been 2001. Actually, it was 2001 pre 9-11, oddly enough, early 2001, like February of 2001. Let's be very specific for no reason that I got this game and what a joy, what a delight Rygar is. Um, and Agilos has, like, obviously the gameplay mechanics, like, Agilos does not have a, like, yo-yo thing that you fling at enemies. Um, but what it does have is a similar old school vibe and a similar feel, um, certain, like, uh, sensibilities like it just gives me the same kind of feels same kind of vibe so that's that's high praise and nine out of a possible 11 it's only a couple shy of an actual Rygar so that's you know like I'm trying to give this game high praise because I really think uh, that they did some things really well here anyway um, so yeah Agilos, fun game, really, really fun game, enjoyed it. If you like the old school vibes, you will like this game. If you don't like old school vibes, sorry, because like games are going in two different directions at once. The one hand, they are getting more old school, but like better gameplay. And on the other hand, they're getting like more wildly realistic AAA. Anyway. All right, people, that's all I've got to say in this one. Let's not prolong it too much. Okay, bye.